Hello everyone, Dragon Goes Japan, and today, thought of the day, I'm going to talk about something really cool here actually, because this is something that I found that kind of goes hand in hand with J uh, Japan, mostly in Okinawa, but also here in the northern islands where I live in Kishu, and then up towards Tokyo and, uh, I'm sorry, Hokkaido. So, we're going to talk about Spam. Um, I like Spam. Spam is like one of the few things that I've eaten here, traditionally from America, because it's, it's cheap sometimes, uh, I only buy it when it's affordable. But Spam has been a long-standing uh, kind of food here in Japan since uh, the Second World War. So when uh, Marines brought it over and everything else, they started eating it. And they use it as kind of a supplementary meat. Uh, they use it on sushi, actually. As if you guys can see, actually, here, they put it on rice like sushi. Um, I've never seen Spam here on rice the whole time I've been here. I believe Okinawa is famous for this. I went to Okinawa. I did not see it. I was hoping to find Spam on food and find the special Spam dish that's actually very famous in Okinawa. I could not find it. But Spam actually has its own special dish in Okinawa because of the Marines that were there. So I don't remember what it's called. I'm sorry about that. But look it up online. It's really cool. I know Chris Abroad did a video when he went to Naha. And Okinawa, he did a video about it. It was really cool. I thought it was amazing. Uh, I just never found the Spam dish. But Spam is kind of the the cheap way to eat here, I would say, compared to some things. It's not cheap for me by price standard at all. Like, this can here was about 500 yen, so about $5 for this, when I traditionally get it for a couple dollars in America, so it's kind of crazy when it comes to pricing. But it's nice if you want something like, this weekend or something since I'm not going to go out and eat. I can just fry up some Spam, have some bread, and it's just kind of one of those things. So Spam is a good alternative for food if you come to Japan. And it's also, since it's an American food, Hormel, you're kind of feel a little bit more at home with eating that. Um, but with that, you can pretty much buy Spam just about anywhere. Um, I always recommend, if you're going to go here, shop at Donkey. You guys remember the Donkey video? That place sells Spam super cheap. I mean, just unbelievably cheap compared to what I'm paying now. Uh, since this one cost me $5, I was kind of a little little price shocked. But that does happen here a little bit when it comes to food and things to buy of that nature. So, but that's how it goes. But when you are shopping for things like canned meats or canned foods here, like Spam, just shop around. Like I've said before, always shop around because you never know. Uh, sorry for the, like, tired eyes, like, lack of sleep. So... Sorry it's been so long on the videos. I've been kind of busy running around. You know, people are sick. I'm trying not to get sick. Flu season's terrible. So just doing whatever I can to stay healthy. So, But this one is about spam. This is not sponsored by Hormel. This is not a promotion or anything. I'm saying that for people who come to Japan, if you're looking for something similar to America and that something that you could eat here and be okay with if you don't like certain things, spam is okay. Uh... Just finding spam at the right price can be really hard sometimes. So just shop around, see what you can do. But spam is a safe, safe alternative to other options here. So go with that route. But as always, everyone, I want to please thank you all for tuning in and watching. Please, as always, leave a comment if you want. Thumbs me up. Turn on the bell notifications. Sorry, my hair. Look at my hair. standing up today. And I'll see you guys on the next video, guys. All right. Bye.